Well, I guess I'm getting quite desperate for uh, making videos because I'm videotaping my brand new freezer that I got a hold of uh, just the other day. And it's almost all set to be loaded up with food. You know, there's something really cool about something that's like brand spanking new. And, uh, you know, it's nice and shiny and new and something you're, uh, you know, you can use. And, you know, this thing really is a cash cow because if you do any kind of couponing like I do, boy, you can save a lot of money if you can get those deals and have a place to store them. So uh, this will be great. And here's a shot of the uh, freezer open here, and boy, it's really roomy in there, and you got the two, uh, the two trays here, and boy, it's really deep in there. Let me tell you, it can fit a lot of food in there. But uh, just a couple little uh, facts about freezers that I was able to figure out and find out by talking to different people. It's always good to keep your food at uh, zero uh, degrees, because from what I understand, that's when bacteria will completely stop uh, reproducing and keep your food from spoiling and um, that's just a little fact there for freezers also these things are very economical to run now uh, should run only about 30 bucks a uh, year to run this which is less than three dollars a month so here it stands ready to be used uh, with a few absurd things above it first thing right here just a little story behind that the old Pepsi clock uh, that clock was stopped in 1998 after my Halloween party at 4 o'clock in the morning, and I haven't used it since. And it's kind of like a uh, conversation piece now, for whatever reason. And to the right here, holy smokes, a beautiful and sexy picture of Natalie Wood. So that should heat things up. You know, I better move that freezer because I don't know how uh, cold the food will be kept. But anyway, enough silliness and corn, and uh, thanks so much for watching this time-wasting video. Okay, sorry about wasting all your time. Bye-bye.